Today, we're playing Lysandra and Mordekaiser with the new infinite dragon, Aristin. Every time this dragon dies, it resummons itself, creating an endless army. Especially with Mordekaiser on the board, you just keep creating more and more dragons. Lysandra is in the deck because after only a couple of Aristins, she's leveled with the Watcher, primed and ready to go. And before we start the gameplay with the new cards, don't forget to check the link in the description if you want a chance to win one of the Runeterra card packs with the new cards, because there's only a few weeks left. So let me know what you think about the deck in the comments and happy high rolling. Okay. I don't know what the hell we're playing against, but we're printing. Oh, I, I got rid of my ramp. And I got the ramp back and we got the dragon. Okay. Uh, I kept this because it seems like it's some sort of elusive deck. Maybe it's a Sunken Temple deck. Sunken Temple didn't get nerfed, so I'm probably already misplaying by not going for a explorer. Hey, Sonia, personal, how much Red Bull do you drink? Like, I want to say two or three a week. Uh, but sometimes I completely quit, which I'm probably quitting next week again. I have like three left or something. So when, when those are done, I usually quit for like a couple of months. What about G Fuel? Never had G Fuel. I'm not trying G-Fuel until they add my name on it, either. I wish I could quit energy drinks. I, I've done it multiple times, but usually, like, when I'm really busy, like, when I stream a lot, I, uh, I unfortunately succumb to it. Best food, you take about six months. G-Fuel has lead in the ingredients? Oh, well, in that case, I might have to try it. I love lead. That's one of my favorite things. It was like I'm chugging drink. Yeah, it's like you just go numb to it after a while, right? Like unironically. I don't know. I feel like I feel like Red Bulls actually work when you don't drink them often. I, it's entirely pointless to drink it more than like I don't know, like once or twice. In well, like once a week even is too much probably. This is why I only drink water. I I honestly mostly drink water as well. But when I stream, I usually have a Red Bull to, uh, I don't know. Feels nice. Be a little more upbeat and whatnot. Okay, well, we're getting close to that turn seven. And then, and then life is just good, right? Life is just insanely good. What I like most about Aristin and printing it is that it has, like, a built-in win con. Give enemies minus one, minus zero. That's so good. That's so insanely powerful. Because you get rewarded for building an army and then attacking with it and winning with Fearsome. Hey. Is it once a week still okay? I mean, best thing to do is just not doing it at all. So, the reason we're playing a Lysandra deck here, chat, is because right after... <laughs> right after this, we're gonna play the Lysandra Adventure. The five-star adventure. It's a new release today. Yeah, I'm playing with new cards. Right here. Aristin, the stinky dragon. I got ways to find me mushrooms. Um, okay, so we'll just do this. I love this car, by the way. I'm glad, uh, I'm glad there's a use for it. How much do he stank? Well, he's green, so a lot, probably. Pay dirt. That's the indication, right? If you like green, you're probably stinky and you don't shower at all. When did it end up releasing? Ten minutes ago. They do give energy, but the crash afterwards is... Yes, yes. I feel that too. It's like you, you, you drink a Red Bull and you're upbeat. And then, I don't know, like four, three hours later, you just like want to fall asleep. You just are completely drained of energy. Yeah, and then it's despair. All right, here we go. Boom. Oh. There yeah, we got another one. All right, this is pretty cool. Another day in the field. I'll pick them, you plant them, kid. They can't block it either. Mini morph? That would... Bro! That's my dragon! What? Hey, come on, man. What's the... 
Bro probably isn't running a single new card, and then they just take hours. You just outbred you? No, I'm just not gonna kill this thing, man. I'll just take one damage at a time. Screw it. Okay, so that's one for Lysandra. Oh, it's so cool, man, that it gives itself deathless. I love it. Oh. oh, another one. So if we play this, we kill our dragon. But then we also kill their dragon. They get stunned though, right? Hmm. Okay, well, let's play the center here. Yeah, there is infinite le deathless on the dragon. So if we have Mordekaiser and we, we kill this with Mordekaiser, we get two. Uh, they they literally print itself because they, they give deathless instantly. Okay, I think this is worth it because this gets stunned and then we can deal with it later. This will also level the Sandra on this dying, by the way. So it, it's just it's just insane. It's just good. You also kill a Teemo and a Nora. Plus you're stunned. Remind the world of true power. It would actually be insane if we just found a way to kill our own you dragon like a couple more times so we could get the watcher to zero as well. That's good value. That's good value. <laughs> I love this skin. It's so good, man. This skin is insane. Every every single like uh, asset of this skin is insane. The watcher, the thrall, the frozen thrall, the tomb. It's all crazy. Oh, they're running monument. Uh-oh. Um, so we attack, they block here, so they block here, we have to kill them fast though, because, you know, shrooms, we have a, we have a tough nexus actually, tough nexus is pretty good against shrooms, oh, that's a right there. so they kill this here, then we play the ice shard, we get another dragon, and then we have Watcher at like zero, basically. What's uh, what's messed up though is that if we use the Watcher, we 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 basically like kill all shrooms in their deck. But you know that's fine. <laughs> this is so funny though, man. Okay, Watcher needs two more. We can literally go Ice Shard into another Ariston. <laughs> What if they condense your watcher? Well, we'll just make sure we play it. We'll make sure we play the watcher over attacking. Here we go. Watcher needs to attack though. That's not, that's not that hard against their deck most of the time. We also have a vengeance, so. Okay, four out of five. Another one. I'm not gonna play it until we attack though. I can all I can I can use this after day attack basically. What is that? A1? It, it it's back! <laughs> it, it when I'm summoned, grant me deathless. So it goes infinite. Every time it dies, it resummons itself, gets deathless. I own this city. What are you doing? Okay, I mean we can we can play this now because they can't condense it. Nineteen puff caps. We have two Aristins, so these all get minus two, which is not enough to stop them from blocking. I could just replace the frozen thrall. Yeah, there's a play here. We're gonna be drawing for it a little bit, but that's fine. Wraith of Echoes. What is Wraith of Echoes? Is that the uh, give everything ephemeral? Oh, it's a two five. Oh, oh, that's that's pretty interesting actually. Wraith of Echoes is hilarious. That's the five mana two five that gives copies of cards that die this turn. Plus one, plus one. That's really funny, actually. That that's I don't think that's a good for this deck, but that's something we should synergize with. Like what we can do is we can play a spider deck 
with Wraith for Echoes, where the spiders are the main thing that get buffed, and then we use this as like our top end. That's kind of cool. Uh, that's the deck we're going to be building, but that's that that that's an entirely different concept, I think. Yeah, we're, we're using Soul Cleave. I think we have two copies of Soul Cleave. But board space might be an issue. The Bodir issue. I was almost running Bodir in this deck, and then I was like, probably can't. Probably gotta run out of board space real fast. Okay, so we summon an 8 cost. The Threshold of the Great Prox gives us two cards. Another card I almost put in this deck is the 3-4. I forgot the name of it. The 3-4 that uses terror on an enemy every time you... And then they come back. Wait, didn't... Didn't I have two of them? I'm pretty sure I had two of them, game! What? You're, you're telling me my infinite dragon dies to a flash bomb from a British lady in a in a top hat? That's the counter? Hello? That was lethal too! I mean, opponent probably left, but I needed three of them to make this go to two so they couldn't block fearsome. Don't let me get nuked again and lose my stuff here. Okay, it's back. Wait, does it get stunned now? Opponent actually found the counter to Ariston. Opponent literally accidentally found the counter. Also, I should have used Harsh Winds, but I think opponent left. Dude. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, it's gone. Not done. Well, that's that's something right there. Just Equinox it. You. I mean, you can. But I'm playing a Mordekaiser deck, so I'll probably just kill my own unit. Right? Is more you counter yourself with drawing? Yeah, let me let me find a way to stop drawing at round start. That's you're right. Actually. <laughs> Three cards left, eight puff caps. I mean Mordekaiser's level two. Like Mordekaiser levels extremely fast too. I want to say that. That's why I put Mordekaiser in this deck too. Third 32 out of 15. You've never seen that, Chad. Don't lie. You've never seen numbers like that. Okay, so here we go. So now we have an extra one, I guess. More the guys are level so fast because of that dragon. <laughs> this is one of the most hilarious cards in the game, low key. The best counter is Purify. Yeah, I mean, you're probably right. Yeah. Purify would be a good counter. Fast is like turn 16. It's round 11, but sure. We're, if we're at 16, I can guarantee you that Mordekaiser would level like the turn after we play Ariston. But then you're playing Purify. Right. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> Two question redeems? Um, oh, there we go. Does Ephemeral plus Trifarian Might on this dragon in Path Champion is just an un unavoidable board clear? I think so, yes. That sounds right. Yeah, I think so. Because it, 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 it has ephemeral, it strikes, kills itself, resummon, strikes again until the entire board is clear. Yeah, that, that actually sounds really good. I am not done with you. I am not done with you. Are we doing a, can a level 10 star champ? A level 10 star champion be Lysander later or just a normal run? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Okay, we're, we're gonna go for lethal this time.
<laughs> Welcome to Brazil, baby. How many? 77 puff caps. Oh, there's more. With one card left. 202. So, we, we played this baby. And Mordecai is just sucks him even more. Here we go. Let, let's see how many streams it is. 202 right now. Kill, kill, kill. Sucked. Oh, we don't even heal from that. 212. We, we've... That was a slay on our own unit, so we actually, uh, we killed some of them. Yeah, so there are, uh... Oh, please, okay. This, <laughs> this is gonna be the most rooms drawn in a single turn, right? Here we go. Here we go. One, one card. How many? 222. Bumba! <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> nice. Very nice. A new game. And as a old player, old league player, I was thinking about LOR. Do you think this is a good time to start? Considering I don't know anything. I don't know if it's easy or difficult, fun or not. Every information about the game is appreciated. Well. I'm I've been streaming Ruterra for three years, and I'll tell you that Legends of Ruterra is the single best card game on the market. It's also very friendly for your wallet. If you're on defense, I would definitely recommend just giving it a shot. <laughs> that's, uh, that, that's how I feel about it. That being said, there will be less support for PvP. There are no competitive tournaments at the moment. So there is, you know, there it's not it's not all great. But that doesn't take away any quality from the game. It's a beautiful game, beautiful art, amazing voice lines, amazing lore story, gameplay included. It's all great. But yeah. Keep that in mind. When new champions in 4 weeks. That's done. Why the heck can't you skip with Mort? At least has up to two units. That implies zero is not an option. I think it might be a, I think a bug because our board was full. They made a change at one point where if you have a full board and you need to target something to kill it, to make room, you don't get like the option to replace a unit. You, you just get the option to kill something. And I didn't want to kill anything, so I couldn't skip either. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's not great how that works. Oh, we're, we're, we're chilling pretty hard. Okay, so we can pass and then play Eradication even. Or I could just attack with this first. We'll attack. See what they play. And if they play like multiple dudes, we Eradicate. Yeah. Now, why would you do that? I just didn't feel like playing the Terror. A brief engagement, but a joyous one. This is eternal. But with a few changes, this uh, this deck is easily standard ready. Every betrayal sharpens our resolve. Thank you, Hey, feel free to DM me if you need any help. I'm always up to uh, help out a new player. Rotar is fantastic, and it, it, it truly deserves much more than it actually got. Much more. So yeah, feel free to slide into my DMs. They are open for you, buddy. We're gonna draw so many cards once we play Mordekaiser. I hope Liz dominates me in Path of Champions. Me too. Me too. Like, look at her. That's uh, that's five star worthy. Huh? You hurt me. You hurt me. Streamer, please. Well, I mean, I, I, I just think Aurelian Soul is really easy. I, I just want to lose games. Is that why is that weird? You're, you're, you're looking at me like I said something weird. I don't think I did. New Shirima card can beat Aristan. It do. It can. 
Sunny wants someone who can beat him. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you. There's nothing that gets me going more than playing against a vain top player. God, I, I just I love the way she tumbles in my direction, if you know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> I can't be the only one. I mean, I'm just gonna do this because, sure, she goes to two out of three, but if she tries to attack, we just block it with the Storm Raptor. When is your brother David going to stream? I'll ask him for you, Pink Rose. I'll ask him for you. <laughs> I'll advertise his stream too when he does. I haven't even been able to rap. Okay, but. Yeah, th that's. That's four Callistas. Alright. When is the end of season? Four weeks. Let me draw some cards. Yeah, they had four Callistas. Oh, okay. Uh, let's kill her. Right. We have nothing to use the Oblivious Islander. I think I'm cutting the Oblivious Islander because there's value in playing Ariston for eight. Walk with me into the gray and know your fate. Um, so one thing they could do next turn is Soul Cleavers. Mm, that's also kind of rough. I could just skip, actually. Probably should have skipped. Got for Explorer? Yeah, that's not a bad call. Two Explorers should be good. So, Nocturne levels. The attacking turf for Nocturne usually isn't that good unless they have a leveled Lissandra, uh, leveled Callista. No, I think we're fine. That is a risky play. Will we be playing North vs. Aesol in like 30 minutes or something? 30 minutes to an hour? This prison is yours. Well, that's pretty good. I am not done with you. Goodbye, board. Harrowing is GG. Oh my god, you're actually right. It would have been. I did not play around it. There he is. Okay, so we, we have to counter. We have <laughs> we have to harrowing counter. Two of them. What is your impression of Nora and Path Champion? I don't know. I haven't played it yet. Make a card prismatic. Ariston, plop, you got it. After this game, we will make Ariston Prismatic. I don't I don't know what Nora's powers do besides the first one, where it says like created allies have plus one plus one. So I'm also assuming that her three star power is created allies have plus two plus two, which is honestly pretty good. Oh no. Anyway. What are you gonna do? Rally? What was the point of that? Her three stars plus oh that's that plus three plus one is better than plus one plus one. Don't spoil her two star power though. The Sanders leveled. Runation is primed. <laughs> They didn't even have the Mordekaiser. Let the printing commence! It's gorgeous, actually. It's so beautiful. That level's Mordekaiser. <laughs> oh, yeah. I love printing. Behold my dominion. <sighs> Battle of 
Plus three plus one is better. No, plus three plus one is better than plus two plus two. That's what I meant. Well, I mean, whatever. Do we have another Mordekaiser? Oh no, we don't. Never mind. We have a level Lissandra though. I can, I can, I can do this. And then we have Watcher next turn. Let's just do it. Let's go for it. Let's just do it. I, I, I don't even think I'm making like optimal plays, by the way. Let me be very clear. Not at all. Does this not work in standard? It does. It does. I, I just added like the Valfies. And I'm trying to get some LP for the Eternal Season. Oh my god. This is more fun, right? Actually, we can do both. I will bless you with death. I am not done with you. <laughs> oh my god. Her three star power is she grants the enemy nexus Big Smelly. It doesn't do anything besides letting the foe know their deck is Big Smelly. Maybe it fits the AI. <laughs> Maybe it tilts the AI. Who could say? That sounds believable, actually. That's something Riot would do. Definitely. <laughs> our, our dragons can't... Yeah, our dragons, they're not going anywhere. They're staying there. They're staying on the board forever. Okay, let's uh, let's cut the one mana card. Bad champion this badly. That's that's pretty new when there's new cards. Yeah, GG Robomaster. That, uh, that, 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 that game was decided in the mulligan. 100%. Okay, Valfis is good. Oh man, I would love that eradication right now. Can you improve perfection? Join me if you want to live with us. Me. Yeah, that thing is gonna be painful. Go for the heal. Prime and ready. Rise, metal brethren. Give in to instinct. Did they fall? It's a very surprising block right there. My first big mission. We are in eternal, so I am going to Valfish you. Okay. Okay, we, we need to, uh, if we can print the Ariston, it's like super good because we have the Lissandra. Like, Tough Nexus wins this game. Instant. So, if we can go here. Maybe even we just play Lissandra and Winter's Touch. And then next turn we Ariston. Right? I hope this works. All things grow cold. Won't find better this side of the sun. Yeah, we need to level Lissandra and then we're good. <laughs> no refunds. No guarantee it'll be easy to level her though. Oh, okay, now it is. That uh that levels Lissandra instantly. Great draw. That's not gonna go the way you want it to go. I'll tell you that right now. That will not work. Because we have Lissandra, baby. Alright, nice. Ages pass, but I am eternal. We just won the game. 
And it's also, is that a Watcher? It depends on the sequencing, right? It's not Watcher next turn. If we got both Ephemeral ones, it would have been. So if we get one more, we have Watcher. I don't think Watcher matters that much, though. We're, we're trying to live through the burn. This. Um, I mean, this is just like almost lethal, right? I think uh, killing them here is, is better most of the time. It's just like... If they have something that deals one, Frost we don't win. This could be lethal. You break it, you buy it. Okay. I mean, that's worth. So come back. This is such a cool deck. I, I would have loved to show it in our game, but I I don't think I would have gotten a chance to. <laughs> okay, so now we have Watcher active. Come closer. I don't bite. At last, they awaken. We're gonna play it and just uh, use this. I think they meant to the shards for monthly. Yeah, I, I think those are available one more month, no? Or am I getting it mixed up? My body is no longer my own. I'm playing with Elder right now. That's my plan. All right. Say goodbye to your deck and your LP. Well, fragments do not work on Acel, no. All right, did you? Very nice. This deck is very fun. I'm gonna try different versions of it, but I like the control version because Ariston is a really, really cool inevitable wing con. Agra, okay. Threshold of the Grays is like fine, but I don't think it wins. Yeah, this is a pretty rough deck to go up against. Because, uh. It's aggro, so. We basically have to get to uh, the Chris Lime Storm Raptor turn. That's kind of okay. Let us take a peek at life beneath the waves. Deathcraft's cultist is Cortis deck? I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Hard to fit in. That's a great draw. This'll be a blast. <laughs> Alright, hey, I've neutralized your entire turn, buddy. They can't even attack with the uh with the conch. Yeah, that's and that's how you deal with aggro, I guess. <coughs> huh. Do you have a Jin drain deck in mind? I do. Um I we're probably gonna be playing that either tomorrow or the day after. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. But they could still play something here. I'm a little bit worried about Poppy. Just need a second. That's fine. Okay, we need to live two turns. I'm 
conj. Sure. Me, 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 me. I killed my own unit, but it is what it is. This is why uh, I was thinking about playing Lysandra. Ultimately, playing Lysandra was better. Because we'd get a good block. Yeah, playing Lysandra would have been a lot better. Because he'd be a 2-2 to be able to block this. But Loki forgot they even run this card. How do you say bless you in Dutch? Gezondheid. Like gezondheid, but different. I mean, we're at 18, right? They have three cards. How bad could it be? I'll tell... <laughs> It's not season tide, it's gezondheid. But we the Dutch have a very ugly G. It's gezondheid. I will bury the world in ice. Where's my axe? So the fun thing about playing against this deck is that once we find Ariston and print it, one attack basically wins it. Know the heroes around here somewhere. Ready, Hammer? We got this! Shatter. It's minus four. Don't love it. So we can actually, uh, I think we might need to print the uh, Lysandra, as weird as that sounds. Strong body, strong mind. Um... Yeah, I think so. Oh, this is... No, I have to do this. I was... Well, I could still do it. I can Soul Cleave Lysandra and then play Mordekaiser to bring them back. Another day, another I think I have to do it just so I can get more blockers for next turn. Because if I live next turn, I'm kind of just good. If two cards. This could be a fervor. And it's gonna look really weird, but I think it's the correct play. Oh, we, we, <laughs> she lost her skin, though. Oh, do I? Oh, I lose one Lysandra now. Oh my god, I'm gonna get screwed here, right? Was this proc first? Oh, god damn it. I, I wish I could replace one of them and I'd have two Lysandras. Now, all I did now was just get rid of her skin. Noticed my beautiful son close to my nickname was missing. Had to fix that. Crush and shatter. Thick go! Thank you for the eight months. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay, play a unit here so I can uh, death realm you. There's Ariston. Okay, ready. Brilliant. I think I'm dead here. Unfortunate. Yeah, it's uh, one decimate and we are done. Oh no. Think you're ready for Lysandra? Yeah, I uh, I don't know. When I read the power and it said everybody gets like a terrifying additional power, I got a little worried. I'm doing a little bit of PvP and then I'm gonna I'm gonna find out, I guess. Should I be afraid? Cause I, I feel like I should be. I feel like I should be very afraid. Hey, that's my Mordecai. Then. Yes, you should. <laughs> All right, I believe you, and I'm still worried. That's why you always carry another pair of goggles. Okay, so our way to win is probably going to be this instead of Mordecai, because what we can do now with this play is use Ariston, attack. Actually, no, this was wrong. No, I messed it up. Frost I think I messed it up. I need to. I needed to keep her at uh, at seven. In the wrist, see? I need to keep this at eight, so it would level Lysandra. I messed up. Uh, you need to be on the left. Okay, so you get resummoned first, and then you. So Lysandra doesn't ruin us with another thrall. Actually, no. Mordekaiser, Mordekaiser like eats a slot. The cold creeps in. All right, well, we might as well go for Lysandra then. The ice is melting. I actually don't know what's better. I think this is better. Slightly. 
I need board space really badly. These thralls are screwing me. Reporting in. Okay, I think it's a thrall diff here. Okay, so if we block with this on the left, Lysandra levels, and we don't take impact damage, that's a big deal. Chat, I can't play Mordekaiser. I can't play Mordekaiser. Because Mordekaiser eats a slot. I think we're alive, though. Playing without killing? You're correct. I I can't. I, am eternal. You are not I can't! I can't kill them because it eats a slot. I, it's not possible. I have to do this. With this Lamak it will work, but yeah. Okay, I can put this left. I think we're, al we're alive. No, I can't kill one because then Mordecai just takes the place of this. It doesn't work. Shatter. I'm still dead. I I got Feels like a bacon. Oh, that's so sad. I <laughs> Lissandra actually threw the game. I <laughs> wait. Brilliant. We we literally lost because Lysandra's thralls. Lysandra's thralls wouldn't let us play one more. Kill drag. It doesn't matter. Like this levels Lysandra, sure. Like this always needs to go left so it resummons, but we're still just dead dead. You cannot fight the cold. See? He's dead. Shatter. I'm I'm so sad. This was so winnable. This was so winnable. I did not know it worked that way. That was a one game, but we got sabotaged by Lysandra and her thralls. Time.